another one for our Dr. Wok sessions, and that is for our brand new cast iron woks. And like any cast iron wok or pan, it needs looking after. You can't just leave a cast iron or carbon steel wok after washing to just dry or sort of mop it dry with a kitchen towel or anything like that. More, more importantly, what it's good for is that it's got a really lovely thick base, retains heat really, really well. It's not necessarily a wok for stir frying and flicking through like that, but if you want to stir fry with it, it's best to sort of use your spatula and go around it. The thick base, great for making curries, braises, things like that, slow cooks, or even deep frying because it retains a really nice even heat across the oil. What's really important is when you're cleaning it, much like a carbon steel wok or a pre-seasoned carbon steel wok, you can clean it on the hob with some bubbling water. Once over in the sink, give it a good scrub. Any metal implements are fine on it, no problems. But most importantly, once it's clean, always dry it on the hob on a high heat until it's bone dry. And then it'll take a little bit of a while to cool, but once it's fully cool, then you can put it away.